Oof. Yikes. I just want to say that I would never, ever make this for myself, but I really hope he likes it. Hey Hi, Jackson. How are you doing? Good. Good? Okay, cool. So, if you could have any dish in the world today, what would you have? It will be dragon fire chicken with pizza stuffed inside. What is that supposed to mean? What is dragon fire supposed to mean? Maybe you could draw it for me and help me help me out a little. Here's the chicken part. Okay, is it just like a regular chicken flavor? Does it have, is it garlicky? Is it spicy? Spicy. It's spicy, you like spicy food? Whoa, okay. What's spicy to a kid? Like how much can he handle? Um, you know, I don't want to go too overboard, so. Just gonna, you know, tiptoe into spicy territory. Oh, that's a big chicken. Let's talk about the pizza. Here's the pizza. What toppings do you like? Peppers. Peppers? Does it have pepperoni? Yes. Yes? Okay. Okay, green and red peppers, pepperoni, pizza. Here's the dragon. That's a dragon? You know, there's a full on dragon inside of this chicken. What? I mean, I, I don't know what I'm gonna do. And you said that there's dragon flames? Uh-huh. What do dragon flames taste like? It tastes like olives. I would assume dragon fire could be like ketchup or, you know, something like red and saucy. And he said it tastes like olive. Okay, this is really helpful. Thank you so much. I mean, I'm gonna try my best. Do you believe in me? Yes. Yes? Okay. That's the vote of confidence I need. My plan, we'll see how it goes. I'm going to pound a chicken breast really thin, put a bunch of spices on it, not too spicy, and then fill it with marinara, mozzarella, peppers, uh, pepperoni, roll it up, and then I'm gonna take puff pastry and brush it with tapenade, and then I'm gonna put the chicken inside of the puff pastry and wrap it up. That way you have some of the like dough component of what pizza could be, and it's gonna hold it all together, so it's not gonna be like this giant mess. I don't know if that's really gonna work, but. We'll see. Okay, so I'm gonna start with just a tiny bit of cayenne. Cayenne's pretty aggressive and Jackson is six, so don't wanna get too crazy. Some Italian seasoning, paprika. Maybe that's like a nod to fire and flames too. Two teaspoons of salt, a little pepper. So he wanted red and green peppers. There's not gonna be that much room for filling, so I don't think we need that much. I was thinking that the pepperoni should be layered, but maybe it should be chopped. Anyone? Pepperoni. Full pepperoni, okay. So now we're gonna pound the chicken breast. Gonna wash my hands. Sorry. And just gonna go for it. So I feel like pounding the chicken breast really thin is just gonna give more options for filling it. It might not be what he intended, but, you know, artistic, um, what the is the word? Thank you, I was gonna say liability, and I was like, yeah, but taking a creative. Liberty. So, spiced chicken. <laughs> I'm gonna wash my hands again. Sorry, I forgot that the oven needs to be preheated, so I just did that, let me just check the temperature. Sorry, what? Oh no, I'm just talking to myself. Now I'm gonna layer some mozzarella on top of this herby chicken. I think a layer of pepperoni. He seemed really enthusiastic about that peppers. Like this feels like a lot to me, but let's see. Oh, and another layer of cheese. Kids love cheese, it's tasty. Okay. So, okay, so this giant chicken mound. Okay, this cheese clearly needs to leave. So we have this like weird chicken log <laughs> that we're gonna chill in the refrigerator um, for a little bit. My work here is done. Um, I forgot marinara sauce. Oh no, it's like kind of crucial to pizza. Should I unwrap it? What should I do? Yeah. Okay. Ah, okay. Back again. Okay. Oh boy. This is like, what am I doing? Okay, back to the fridge. So now that the chicken is chilling for a bit, I'm gonna roll out the puff pastry and see if I can make some puff pastry flames. <laughs> Does this look like a flame? I don't know. It looks like a sad turkey hand. Like maybe it needs some more like flames on flames, like layers of flames. Wait, huh? 
You know, actually, if you hold this upside down, it could almost look like this flame. I feel like the bone is more successful than the fire. It unfortunately does look like a dog bone. I feel like he could have, you know, he could have tried to do something similar. Now I'm going to brush the puff pastry with olive tapenade, since dragon flames taste like olive, of course. With beef wellington, you have a layer of like minced mushrooms called duck cell, so maybe the tapenade won't be that bad. So I'm just gonna fold it up like a little present. Okay, so it turns out that this is smaller than I anticipated, so maybe there's only room for one flame. I think the flames can overlap. It looks like a dragon egg. Hey, that's a really good start. So I'm gonna brush it in egg wash, um, sprinkling it with flaky sea salt because, you know, I doubt Jackson will care, but I just feel like it'll make it a little nicer. And in the oven it goes. Um, the bone's a little dark. So this needs some more time, but I need to remove this so I don't feed him a totally charred bone. This is not my best planning, let's say. It actually looks better than I anticipated. I feel like the flames actually really came to life um, in baking. It did explode a bit on the bottom, but he's not gonna see that. And I know it didn't call for parsley, but I just can't help myself. Jackson's about to eat this weird creation. I don't know if he was expecting this kind of interpretation, but I, I feel like it looks good, and I hope the flavors work together. Cross my fingers. Are you ready to see what I made? Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so everything is inside. So the chicken and pizza stuff is all inside of here. What do you think so far? <laughs> okay, let's see. Do you want to try it? Yes. Yes? That's a huge knife. It is a huge knife. Whoa. So there's the chicken, and inside there's pepperoni and cheese and peppers. There's olives on the outside of it, because that's what you said dragon flames taste like. OK, ready? Is it spicy? Too spicy? Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Too spicy. Okay, so I'm I'm a little afraid to do this now, but if you had to rate this dish in emojis, here are all your choices. <laughs> that's probably accurate. <laughs> you know what? That's a that's a fair assessment. It's not that bad. Which one? <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm this one. It's not that bad. It kind of tastes like pizza chicken. Maybe if it wasn't spicy, it would have been better. Take some creative liberties to make sure this isn't like absolutely repulsive. Um, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.